but let me let me make sure I don't miss my S and P trade. Are we close? Yes. Look at this. We're there. Okay, we hit it. I I should get a notification like right now. Hello. We're just gonna turn that off so we don't get blasted on stream. Okay, guys, we've got nine minutes until the show goes to the next person. So let's take this trade. I'm gonna go ahead and get long S and P 500, picking it up again here this morning. Um, give me one second to load up my my platform here. S. Uh, let's go Weeble. So for those of you who aren't familiar, I trade on Weeble because I can't trade CFDs as a US client here in the US. When trading on a regulated Forex broker, I can't trade SPX 500. I can't trade US 30 on a regulated entity. So what I have to do is instead, I just trade it on the stock market. But it's the same thing as if I were to try and trade SPX 500. So SPX 500 pulling back to a level that I like. I'm going to go ahead and pick it up long here. Um, I'm going to go for 200 shares here. Let me go ahead and get it uh, a market order going. Give me just one second here. And uh, I'm going to put a stop here. Let me, let me figure out my stop loss placement before I get too far ahead of myself. Um, so... Let's see, where are we at with this? Looking left. Uh, sorry, I've got two screens pulled up. You guys can only see my trading view, but I'm pulling up my broker as well. 75, I'm going to take this trade here. Give me one second. Um, unlock trading. Pull this up here. And we're going to go ahead and I'm going to go ahead and buy SPY here. All right, we're in. Stop loss is in place just above here. So let me go ahead and line that up on my secondary and again, we're repeating the process, taking another trade here on stream today. It's a busy day. Um, I'm going to pick it up long here. Stops are going to go. So we're in the trade. Let me go ahead and get this trade alert shared with members. Again, getting confirmation off the edge finder as well here this morning. That's why that's why I have to jump into it during stream. Um, you know, I don't always take my trades on stream directly, but it's just sometimes they line up at the same time. So I have to take them two trades here on stream today. What a busy day. Hold on. Let me um, clear this. All right. Two trades. We went long in ZDCHF and now we are back into that S&P 500 trade, which is, by the way, immediately going against us. So we'll see if that one can uh, can catch a bit of a bounce, a little bit of volatility here this morning on the New York Open as things get going. If that one stops out, it's okay. It's not the end of the world. It's a small position and uh, we will go from there. So let me pull up the stream here again. Let me make sure I can see what's going on. And there we go. Yes. So we are long uh, NZDCHF and long SPX 500. So thank you for the updates, Jim. All right, guys, and we are all out of the S&P 500 for a profit of about $1,000 here, which is awesome. A nice little trade to uh, to sort of wrap up the week. We caught this pullback beautifully, and you can see price shot all the way up. And, you know, I'm going to be honest with you. I trailed my stop pretty tight here. Uh, and the reason for that is price came up into this area here, poked up, and briefly as the New York session got started today, looked very, very bullish. When that happened on stream here today, as I stream at 9.30, which is right when the stock market opens, things looked pretty good. And I went ahead and I said, hey, you know what? If price breaks through this structure, we're gonna go ahead and take the stop loss, uh, the trailing stop loss for a profit of around $1,000. Uh, and so that is what ended up happening as we got a lot of rejection here on today's uh, price action. I decided, you know what? Uh, that's going to be a, a good point for me to just close the trade and take some profits. So we made a really nice little uh, move here, just catching the pullback, as you guys saw in this video from start to finish. I hope you enjoy these videos. If you do get something out of them, hit the thumbs up button, subscribe. And remember, come join us in Discord. Get a part of the action uh, where we're taking these trades real time, calling out the trade alerts with full breakdowns and explanations so that you can actually see them, learn from them, and look over the shoulder of myself and my team who are trading on a regular basis. Hope to meet some of you guys inside of the Discord. Discord, and with that said, see you later. It looks like you made it to the end of one of my videos. Thank you so much for supporting my content. It really means the world to me. And down below in the description, I put together some of my best resources for aspiring traders who are looking to improve. I've got some free downloads that could help you, some broker recommendations. And if you'd like to join our Discord or get access to some of our trading software, all of that will be linked down below in the description. Thanks for watching and we'll see you next time.